Today I am at Lafleur's Bluff State Park, right in the heart of Jackson. Literally 12 minutes from where we're staying. Found it online today, and uh, I can squeeze that into an afternoon. They have a few short trails. It's a pretty good sized park, but the trails are very short and small. But um, got some cypress swamp going on in the Pearl River over here. Um, Lafleur's Bluff was started as a trading post by a French Canadian trader. Um, Louis Lafleur in the late 1700s, I believe, and actually became the state capital of Mississippi um, in 1821, I think. That was even before the Treaty of Dancing Rabbit Creek, when the Choctaw ceded this land too. Hmm. But that's what it said, so we're gonna go with it. But <clears throat> they have a nine-hole golf course and a, uh, a natural science museum with aquariums and camping and fishing and a lot of great stuff here boat ramp to the Pearl River but what we're here for is to see what these trails have for us if there's any photographic opportunities it's only four dollars to get in um, and looks like the kind of place you could spend a good afternoon or if you were a city dweller in the city of Jackson you could probably spend the weekend here and have a pretty good time but we're gonna check out the trails I think I started backwards. I think the trail actually starts over at like the Natural Science Museum. Um, I came back to the day use area from the boat ramp and I started on apparently the hardest trail, the purple trail, the only trail that comes from this side. Um, not real concerned about it being super hard. It's only a half mile long, but it's got some really cool views just right out of the gate as soon as you take off. Got cypress knees and cypress trees. Very serene. Well, I would say this path is currently closed. We'll find a way around. It's a cool view of the river, though, huh? Look at that. Definitely sections pretty rough it's not the worst thing i've ever seen but i've had a lot of storm damage it appears back in here in some places and uh it's a uh, definitely human definitely a little human who thought a swamp would be human i mean who knew right oh, that's pretty dang cool you walk on down here there's a low head dam Old railroad bridge, which left the one anyway. That water's moving too. You can still hear the city um, very plainly, though it is a bit muted, but it's obvious you're in a city. You can still hear it, but somehow it is still so very secluded down here I mean you can hear it but man it's very pretty still hear all the birds Check out the shrooms. Yeah. Well, I guess the purple trail may be all I'm hiking today because I don't know where to go from here. This is the trail I was on. I came out to this point. Now I don't really see where to go. See, there's a path that way and that way. But when you look at this sign, says pipeline road dead end both ways waterworks boundary and eubanks creek um assuming because this goes straight across that maybe is the path but i don't know if you can see it there's i mean it's full of water and it's overgrown but you know judging by these barriers i'm assuming the path goes up through there but like <laughs> i didn't come prepared to do that today so i don't know I guess we're gonna turn around and go back. 
I will say this. Um, it definitely needs some work down here. Um, clearly the trail has some storm damage, so that, not faulting them for that, because that seems to be pretty recent. But like that, I don't know what the heck's going on with that. If that's the trail, like, ain't nobody touched that trail in a while. And I'm not walking through ankle deep water and grass that's waist deep. I'm not that avid of a hiker. Um, and it's not well marked. Well, this could quite possibly be the shortest video I've ever shot. But, um, it's also one of the shortest trails I've ever hiked. We'll say this. It's humid here. And that half mile, well, that'd be a whole mile now. And it took it out of me. Um, y'all, you know, I walk like 10 miles a day at work. I hike all the time. I'm pretty darn good shape. And we have humidity in Arkansas too, but not like this. Not like swamp humidity. Holy crap. Anyway, yeah, that'll do it for today if I go ahead and make this video. Let's go ahead and let's do this. Let's get a pretty shot of this view through the swamp to uh, do the housekeeping. So that is today's video. Lafleur Bluff State Park. If you guys enjoyed the video, please like and subscribe. I would sincerely appreciate it. And we will catch you next time. We here at Studio 119 would like to remind all of you out there listening, wherever you might be, that though the hill might be steep and the trail be rocky, the mountaintop awaits. Carry on.